Yo, yo, how y'all doing? I just wanted to come at y'all with some stuff that I seen. You know, we're gonna get straight into it. You know what I'm saying? We growing the channel. We just, uh, like every other channel that's exposing the matrix and things of that nature. We just catching things that we see that don't add up. And we just, uh, you know, seeing if we can get a little discussion in the comments and stuff like that just to wake people up across the world. Just to let y'all know that they pushing agendas, they playing what is right in our face. And remember, you know what I'm saying? They put it right in plain sight. So most of the time, you know what I'm saying? We'll overlook it and it's right in our face. It's like the other day, they said the MK Ultra was in the one of the first Call of Duty games. And I look back, I'm like, damn, I do remember that. But you know, we'd be so into like, oh, this game is so realistic. This game is hard. But bro, they putting stuff in there that is crazy. But let's get into this video. This video is on Kodak Black. I believe Kodak Black is either probably locked up or probably probably did man but he's probably locked up because it just we've seen a whole lot of different transformations of him every time we go to jail they come out looking different and as you can see in this background right here his hair is a little blondish and they say the blondish hair represents being fully compromised aka mk ultra you know what I'm saying? you can do your research on that that's very real you know what i'm saying uh so you know we're gonna get straight into it and notice right here this is like recent when kodak got out and he with johnny dang right now look at all the weird activity and stuff like that. I understand, like, you see, the thing that get overshadowed the most is, like, don't you know, like, when you go to jail, you want to come out and just, you know, be around your family and shit like that. These rappers get out and they go right back to the nonsense. Like, even Kodak, he got locked up so many times. He was like, bro, maybe he just a little slow or something because why you keep going to jail? Or was that Kodak? Because, you know, the Kodak, the original Kodak was very rebellious, of course. I got hit the Kodak when he was, like, Somebody sent me a link to his music when he was like hella young. And he was actually nasty, like way nasty when he was young. You know what I'm saying? He had like a, a little accent type of rap he could switch up to. You know, his style switched up a whole lot. I used to listen to him on the Institution mixtape, I believe. That song, Boss Your Life Up, that song was hard. That was like a real motivational song. And I know we ain't get into it yet, but let's get into it. So Peep Kodak. Peep Kodak. What did y'all see off top? Off top, I see. That he got like a new tattoo on his forehead. You see how he got like this little tattoo. He got all these tattoos on his face. He still got those on both cheeks. No, no, no. He got one on one cheek now. He covered the other one up with a flower. And this top one, it kind of looks like a... I don't know. It looked like a car emblem or something like that. But it kind of really looked like a bathroom. You know what I'm saying? If you really look at it, that's crazy. That's not Kodak, but That's not Kodak. One of these is not Kodak. They said that could have been Pee Wee Longway. I believe it. Look at the expressions. Look at the face. All right, for one, let's look at the eyes on the one on the, uh, the left side. He got like bags under his eyes. And notice how he got the glasses on. And they'll do a little other like wildish outlandish activity to throw you off to make it seem like, oh, that's just Kodak violin. I don't even think that's Kodak. This other one, I don't even know that's Kodak either. And notice also yeah. he has a little bit of blonde at the end of his hair. Let's get it. So this could be a new phase because they say every phase of the hair coloring is like a new phase in the celebrity stuff like you know for a human being a regular human that's different we're not like in that spotlight we're not doing all this stuff we don't have to do that but for them oh yeah bro that's a transformation if you don't believe me look at uzi when he blew up you feel me uh look at uh look at cardi right now look at cardi before how he had black hair how he got red hair right now he doing all type of weird stuff let's get into more evidence because i got more evidence this is just a video that i seen Let's get into some pictures that'll show y'all exactly what it is, you know what I'm saying? Because Kodak probably gone. Alright, so this is what it is right here. This is like the junk that was in jail. You feel me? And this is probably an imposter right here. Or this, nah, I don't think this is the real Kodak. He's too chubby, bro. He's too chubby. You don't know about this. And then you see that, then you see this. You see this. I notice the eyes. Don't notice the eyes with this one. They got like a flower tattoo right there. Look at the forehead. They got like some bunny rabbit type of bathroom type of emblem. I don't know what that is. You see the blonde right here at the end? It's blonde right there. So that represents he breaking away from the MKL. So look at this. This is definitely not Kodak. Who is that? I don't know who that is, bro. I don't know who that is. And look at this. And even in this video, it's a video. Who's like, hey, uh, hey guys, I'm a suburban kid. I'm from the suburbs. I'm not from the hood no more. Like he did that. And I'm like, you know, Kodak wouldn't do that. He probably, would. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Like some stuff is joking, but it's like, ah, I don't know. He was so hood. Would he have done that? 
Eh, I don't know. Let's keep it moving, though. Look, this is the original Kodak. This is the original Kodak. Just like Dave Chappelle, they said Dave Chappelle was real skinny. He wanted to be fast, you know, agile, things of that nature. So you wouldn't just throw that all out the window and just be like, yeah, I'm about to get buff. Now, I understand people eat good, they get money in their pockets, so they're eating more. You know what I'm saying? You're going out to five star restaurants, all type of stuff. Your family eating, you eating, your homies is eating. But come on, man, you meant to tell me this guy came up from the hood and he keep going back to jail. Nah, dog, that's a programming thing, bro. Look, another thing. Like, like this is this is the meme that they should have when you're looking at the new code. Like, who the hell is that? Who is that? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, let's, let's bring it back to this one more time. But, like, look, who is this? And look, even his eyes. Look at his eyes. He got bags all under his eyes. Look like he ain't get no sleep in days. You know what I'm saying? His face, his face structure is way fatter. It look way different. How do you go from that to this? You see how dramatic our skin he got, bro? Look, it looks like the original form of Kodak. That's why they know they're playing. Look, you see this. Look at the structure of the body and all that. Then let's go here. Okay. This is the original Kodak. This is a straight Haitian young man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Kodak was Haitian. Kodak was a G, you know what I'm saying? Like the real Kodak. All these other clones, I'm like, bro, I don't know who they are, bro. It's getting spooky in the rap game. You feel me? Hey guys, I'm from the suburb. I don't have to be a suburban kid anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Should I even get any more video? Let's look at this old Kodak. Let's type it in real quick. I don't even need no audio or nothing. I just want to see something, like right here. You can see that like this, the Kodak had the little Margie, Maggie Simpson, Jumps, the little rubber band. I don't know what them things is. <laughs> you feel me? This is the original Kodak. We could tell. This is when Kodak was starting to get in trouble, mainly at the beginning. You know what I'm saying? And remember, Kodak had the boosty fade at the very beginning. When he was coming up. So been a lot of transformations. A lot of transformations. And this is right here. This is telling right here. Got your hands like a triangular figure with the, you know, the blonde hair representing fully compromised. Let's see if we can find a little bit more of that. We're going to end this in a little bit, but, um, you know, we just want to get into it from a different perspective. Let me see. Kodak Blonde here. Where is it at? Kodak Blonde here. Yep. Kodak. All right, let's just get this. Let's get it, bro, because we got to get into some evidence. I said somebody said Bodak Yellow. That's a joke with um Cardi, because Cardi had did a song, and, uh, Kodak was like, yeah, I should get some bread off that because she took my whole concept or something along those lines. And they making a joke about it in the comments. But let's get into it. I just want y'all to peep the, the body language and things of that nature. Now, I don't think nobody in their right mind would just go from having fully vibrant black hair Unless you get inspired, you see somebody else like, oh, that looks cool to want to dye your whole head. Like, even me, I put a little dye in my junk, but I ain't dyed my whole head because that's just like, nah. I ain't trying to go out here looking like no Goldilocks, no shit. Hell no. Hey, yeah, you feel me? They're like, nigga, what the fuck? You about to start dating white girls next. <laughs> no disrespect to white people, but it's like, bro, we got to be who we are. Why the hell are we trying to be like somebody else? <laughs> who are influencing us? They're handlers. Yes. And that's in this video, Kodak is getting his hair dyed, uh, bleached. Bleach blonde, bro. Shout out to Conscious X because he just did a fire video on uh, Dave Chappelle. I'm like, damn, I thought Dave Chappelle was somebody else. And we just got, um, well, it's definitely confirmation. The one dude looked exactly like him. Uh, check out Conscious X channel, man, because, you know, even him, he having me get better with my videos. Like I said, I'm just not starting to get more into this. So, you know, just give me some time to work. I'm going to start getting better with it. I promise you that. I'm just put more time into it, you know. And just be just trying to just uh, break the matrix, you know what I'm saying? So or what I it is. It. You see that? What? I just want to show y'all that a little bit. Alright, even right here, look. And this is when they was done. Look at this, bro. Oh, that's the yes. Kodak. This nigga look like Kodak. Matt, like Marcus Simpson, bro. Look at this here. This is like a parody, bro. They're just making fun of us. <laughs> They've been playing with us, man. They've been playing with us. And notice how he didn't even say anything. He didn't say anything. It's just kind of weird, bro. Look at this. Another one. Another one. I just want to tell you, show y'all the facts, facts. 
out and went diamonds and then snatched them diamonds out and went back another diamond and I bite like That's called that little brother that what they say. Or oh, like uh, like a dude that refers to as little brother. So at this time, he was definitely MK Ultra, bro. Y'all can't say he wasn't. He was fully compromised at this time. But this is when Kodak just had the institution to mix it. So he went into jail, came back out, all of this stuff started transpiring, bro. And I rock with Kodak. Like, until he started doing outlandish stuff. That's why I unsubscribed from certain stuff. But just like X before, when X was on that wild wild stuff, shaving his eyebrows, all that, it's, I couldn't understand it. So I, I, I didn't gravitate towards that. I was like, I don't know. I'll just stick around for the music because the music was creative. But you don't want to ever be subscribing to no people that get too dark, bro. Like, understand, we human beings out here. We're trying to figure out the real world. We're not trying to, you know what I'm saying, figure out what y'all... I mean, we're trying to figure out what y'all want, but we're not trying to be like y'all. Because y'all uh, y'all got to do this for your handlers. You you selling out everything that you believe in for some dollars, bro. Probably ain't even in that bitch. Donald Trump got a whole bunker uh, 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 around. Turn the AC volume down, bro. What you got going on? 1800 block, bro. <laughs> But I just want y'all to pick out a pattern with this right here. Every time Kodak get out, he got a new chain, he got new tats, he got a new hair color, he got a new puppy, he got something like that. He got a jeweler beside him. Does that represent being out, bro? You was in jail for how long? In the recent one, look, 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 look. hold on, I, I gotta find the joint where he was in, cause this is facts. Kodak jail, cause he was in jail, right? And then he had look, this right here. Kodak this Black was very tough. for help from prison leaked footage. Last year, just as he was preparing for his rolling loud performance in Miami, Kodak Black was arrested by federal agents for several. I want to see the picture. That's the old old shit. But he had so many times over the years of doing this wild stuff. His client stated even the Ebro interview where in Ebro he went to Ebro. His client is grateful to have moved to the Illinois facility, adding that the guards there are they take that video down, bro? Because they'd be, they'd be real sneaky with this. Kentucky. Moving forward, Cohen said that the goal is to get... Cody oh, hold on, I didn't see this. What the hell is this? Look at this. Look at this. This is that same pose that Kanye did when he was standing right next to um Donald Trump, bro. That's MK Ultra, And he had his hair blonde at that time, bro. Oh, my God. We're seeing a pattern with this, bro. We got to stop letting our black men fall victim to this bro for some dollars look at all these jewish men around him and stuff like that bro got love for the people but bro stop selling us out because this is making us go back years many years i don't know bro it seemed like now from a from a higher consciousness perspective it seemed like kind of like like he like not kodak but i mean kodak it seemed like kodak got his act together right he seemed more calm relaxed right here but I don't think that's Kodak. I don't think that's Kodak, bro. It's almost seemed like, why is he even here? And this guy right here, I'm pretty sure he's a handler, bro. Whenever you got somebody real close to you like that, it's a handler. Well, let's, let's bring it back real quick to the other picture where he just got up. Something that I've uh, seen in the background. So let's see this picture right here. Look at this picture right here. This guy looked like a undercover fed or something like that, like Miami Vice, like one of them Vice City police officers. Look at this. Look at his feet position. What is that about? Ooh, nobody stands like that. Look at that shirt, bro. That silky type shirt. Look at Kodak face. Notice how they got to put the emphasis on the jewelry. And the cameraman is right here. What did we notice from that? The cameraman was just at that. Hold on. Let me see that, bro. I got this video probably. Hey, man, I got to start. Ha! <laughs> Kodak jail fix. What that joint at? He had this joint where he was there. This right here, look. Look at this. This is staged. Look, they walking him to that direction. Why is a cameraman over there, bro? I'm about to save this picture, bro. That's ridiculous, bro. Let's get a, let's get a more of a clear view of it. Look, the cameraman right there. Like, oh, I got you, Kodak. I got you on camera, buddy. You feel me? Got the, I don't know if these real feds or fake feds. Look at him. Look at his face, bro. This is almost reminds me of like a, because Clutch Williams does, um, Clutch Williams does, uh, does parodies and videos and stuff like that. Let's go to Clutch Williams' channel, bro. This video gonna be different than everybody else's. My mind is flowing right now. All right, so look, let's go to Clutch Williams' channel and then type in Kodak. Cause he be like, he got this dude that look like Kodak. He's like, look, look, that almost look like this dude right here, bro. Don't that look like him or something? These fake Kodaks all out here, bro. Like, come on, it's funny now at this point. It's not funny cause like, he got a mom, you know what I'm saying? He got shit like that, it's crazy. But this is like, that right there is the same as, as this other one. 
is the Miami Vice dude in the back. The Vice City police officer guy. Look at his feet position. Just let you know the stage. This is stage right here. Kodak look like, oh, he look like he out of it. I don't even know what he on. And Peep is here. He got the blonde at the end of his hair. You see how they changed the color? He just had a whole blonde hair. Look like a Super Saiyan out there. And this man got written like red marks on his head. I don't know what that is. That's probably something extra. But the camera is right here. The guy is in the back. He just so happened to stand in this position, right? I don't know what that's about, bro. But yeah, I just wanted to get a different perspective on this whole Kodak thing. But I just wanted to show y'all who is this? Who is that? Who is this? And who is this? This look like this. That look exactly like this. Like, did y'all get the dude from Clutch Williams channel to play that, bro? But you <laughs> and go ahead, rate, subscribe, and comment, man. We're gonna keep it going for these videos. Shout out to Conscious X. Shout out to uh, I Expose C. Shout out to everybody that's breaking down this stuff, bro. Cause you know what I'm saying? This ain't about just us and no egos and nothing like that. This is about waking up people. That's what it's all about. That's why I started getting on these channels more. Or on my channel, I should say. I ain't trying to think I'm better than nobody. I'm just, I'm learning just like y'all. So we spread this information. We all in this together. Shout out to all y'all, man. Hey.